Welcome back. We continue our 25 Sports Vault series looking at Peoria's Hall of Famer, Jim Tomey. Now I'll level with you. As a kid, I couldn't help but admire Jim Tomey's check swing, pointing to the pitcher. Then he would swing back and then unload a swing unlike any other. From Peoria to the big leagues, Jim Tomey entered the majors at 20 years old in 1991. The Tribe lost over 100 games during his rookie season, but gradually turned things around. Fast forward to 1995, where Big Jim became the pitcher's nightmare, clubbing a then-career-high 25 home runs with a lethal Cleveland team that won 100 games. The Windians made their way to the Fall Classic, but fell to Atlanta in six games. Cleveland earned another chance two years later, only to have their hearts broken again, this time to the Florida Marlins in seven. While he didn't leave with a ring, Tomey powered his way to 334 homers in 12 seasons with the Indians. In 2002, Tomey earned a payday, signing a six-year deal worth $85 million with the Philadelphia Phillies. He returned the favor leading the National League with 47 round trippers in 2003. After socking 42 in 2004, an injury sidelined him for the 2005 season. Later that fall, Tomey joined a Chicago White Sox team, fresh off a World Series title, racking up 42 big flies, the American League's comeback player of the year. In 2007, Tomey joined the 500 home run club, walking off in style. In 2008, postseason Tomey returned. In a tiebreaker for the division title, Tomey's seventh inning solo shot put the Windy City in a frenzy. The round tripper was the only run scored that game, punching an October ticket for the White Sox. Like a fine wine, Tomey's swing graced with age. Finishing off his final few seasons with several different teams, he climbed up the home run ladder capping off at 612, eighth overall on the all-time list. Tomorrow night at 10, we conclude our look at Tomy's career with his call to the hall, a moment shared with so many, including his late father, Chuck. Grace?